Mother's Day can be tough for those who've lost their moms. Jessica Maduker spoke with a Racine family who's focused on getting justice in honor of a young mother whose life was cut tragically short. Mother's Day will never be the same for the Booker family. First one, I don't need more to come without her. It's hard enough for Leonard Leary, who lost his daughter two weeks ago today, but his six grandchildren lost their mother, the most important person in their lives. Words can't explain. You know, my daughter was everything to me. 30-year-old Brittany Booker of Racine was shot and killed. She was found dead in her car near 13th and Villa on April 24th. The man who police say did it, Terry Jackson, is still on the run. Instead of focusing on the horrific way Brittany died, family is remembering how she lived this Mother's Day. If Brittany was here, I'm sure they'd be at some water park or somewhere doing what mothers do. Leonard and other family members are stepping up to help raise Brittany's children, the youngest only two years old. They still process it. While grieving together, the family is also making a public plea for anyone who knows where Terry Jackson is to turn him in. Knowing he is brought to justice will help them heal. I need your eyes. I need your ears to the ground. Let's get this guy before he gets somebody else. We're seeing police have already charged three different women for helping Terry Jackson and letting him stay in their homes. If you have any information about his whereabouts, you're asked to call Racine police in the newsroom. Jessica Maduker, TMJ4 News.